Environment is everything around us. It could be living or non-living things. It includes birds, animals, trees, reptiles, insects, mammals, physical, chemical, and other natural forces. Living things live in their environment. They consistently interact and adopt themselves with the condition in the environment. The environment includes water, soil, air, and non-living beings who develop its existence interacting with each other. However, man and his relationship and other living organisms have succeeded but not with the obvious challenges which includes air pollution, water pollution, deforestation, improper management of waste products. An organism is seen to be an assembly of molecules functioning as a more or less suitable whole that exhibits the properties of life. Organisms are complex animals, complex chemical systems organized in ways that promote reproduction and some measures of sustainability. Nevertheless, it is living organisms that determines the fitness of an environment. The relationship that exists between man and living organisms includes one, nutrition. Living organisms need food, bring plants, make their own food through photosynthesis, incorporating the energy of sunlight. Therefore, animals obtain food by eating other organisms. Nutrition is necessary for the growth of organisms. Rescription. All living organisms obtain energy from food when it is broken down. This process requires oxygen. Rescription. All living organisms rescrete waste materials produced as a result of living process metabolism. All living organisms show irritability this is the capacity of responding to change in the internal and external environment. Reproduction. All living organisms has a limited lifespan. The organisms and short species survive by producing young individuals in the same general characteristics as themselves. Growth. All living organisms form new tissues from their food intake. Movement. Animals are distinguished from plants by the ability to move from one place to another. This is essential in seeking out food and the meat. Therefore, the environmental issues and harmful effects of human activities on the biophysical environment, such as improper disposal of waste management, which can greatly affect the health of a population living near the populated areas. Exposure to improperly handled waste can cause a lot of hazards in the environment. Carelessness with waste management does not just affect us. Animals likewise suffer the effects. Pollution must be taken seriously as it has negative effects on the natural elements that absolutely need life to exist on earth such as water and air indeed without it or if they were present on different quantities animals including human and plants will not survive and for animals who consume grasses near contaminated areas or or land fields are also at risk of poisoning due to the toxics that sneaks into the soil Nowadays, we are suffering environmental problems such as global warming, large floods, erosion. One of the causes of this problem is the misbehavior of people towards waste management. Some people are reckless in, in throwing their cabbages. They do not think of the possible results of their actions on the environment as well as on their health. Therefore, waste disposal can be defined as a method used to discard unwanted substance or material. All waste disposal activities endanger environmental problems 
on a location. Improper waste disposal is a disposal of waste in a way that has negative consequences for the environment. For example, littering hazardous waste is a dump into a ground and not recycling items that should be recycled. Therefore, some, some of the causes of waste disposal management includes the following. Ignorance. People are ignorant about proper waste disposal. People are unaware of the consequences of their unwise act. Laziness. Laziness can cause improper garbage disposal because people do not follow the correct rules of proper waste disposal. Rather, they throw it at what place they want and they do not care what will likely be the effects of their actions. Greed can also cause improper garbage disposal, for example, burning tires of wheels and plastics instead of keeping it or tread the S automobile cars tires to maximize on it. These are the likely effects of waste disposal. One could affect the lungs, such as heart disease, heart problems, skin irritations, problems or abnormality in breeds and more. It could affect our climate change as some waste decomposes it really greenhouse gases into the atmosphere like creeping of hair on earth that may affect the abnormality of weather conditions like more storms and other negative happenings till now air pollution the open burning of waste causes air pollution or greenhouse effects for example burning of tires and plastics soil decomposition the, this can cause by the problem of man-made chemicals first factor are human human factor that constitutes environmental issue then we have called other disasters but the greatest one we are fighting today is human we are the one who pollute the environment eh? by one way or the other so environmental protection environmental That's problem waste environmental and is transmitted bacteria from waste to infected wounds nevertheless mosquitoes is known to live and breed in sewage areas and is known to carry life-threatening diseases such as malaria careless handling of waste is slowly killing our only one planet Soy factor erosion is another factor that, that can cause environmental pollution through soil erosion. Seal, seal is transported to water bodies, making water unclean for human consumption. One major cause of environmental pollution is oil sewage. When oil is treated in water, it kills the aquatic animals, thus carrying the composition that will later that will further lead to pollution nevertheless if we can determine today there are many remedies as to the solutions of waste disposal management one through decomposition decompose your waste is an option for getting rid of your household waste you can decompose lots of items food waste animal waste yard waste and lot more recycling recycling is another option for getting rid of waste therefore we are encouraged to buy products that are good for the environment instead of purchasing those plastic pot bottles find a way that you could that you can buy things that are environmentally friendly. Some of these include bottle openers, calendars, coloring books, and lots more. 
it is very sad to know that many lives have been sacrificed because of these calamities that have come. Many places in the Philippines are down to flood every time flood problem rises due to improper manage of waste products. A large and a large number of families have lost their shelters and have nothing left for them. Their wealth has been ruled by storms. We are experiencing very hot weather because of greenhouse effects and global warming. Many kinds of diseases occur because of untidy environments. Others can no longer smell and breathe the fresh air. All of these are effects of improper waste management. Therefore, what are you waiting for? Stop improper disposal and we do to reduce, reuse, recycle for the betterment of our country. It's your name Wonderful is what you are to me It's you I see in my dreams Every day and I pray for you Queen of my life You are so beautiful so beautiful, Amy Wama Maka, Talere, yeah, yeah, yeah. My mommy, oh, Rodjuri, that is why I'm loving you, Nitori Ama. Ooh.